We're at Bearboat Broadcasting, Norma Sucks Plotting. We're into the metro section of the Oregonian in the city of Portland, Oregon. Two ladies running for the city council seat. Remind you of this. This city has to have, equivocally right now, none of the above on the ballot for mayor and council seats and president of the United States. Because no one can do the job. The job is in such conflict of interest and the pandering and pahinky going on. The city is so vulnerable because of it. Poor Portland, Oregon. No one guarding the interests of the city in terms of the governing staff speaking up and resisting every contracting moron going, aloop, aloop, aloop. They are licked from one side to the other. These people's hides have no skin left from the licking going on behind the scenes. Night and day, they are licked and licked and licked. <clears throat> to me, you can have one conversation a day with one person. That's it. There's a time you think. <laughs> by yourself. You plan by yourself. Mm -hmm. No reading for you, by the way. You just do it all in your mind. You're isolated in a room. You're a mayor or councilman in Portland, Oregon. You may talk to no one. Because of the conflict of interest approaching you everywhere. You look like David, king of Israel. Conflict of interest. David, king of Israel. Conflict of interest to the day. King David. A mockery to the process. Poor King Saul. David and Samuel mocking the process. <laughs> Scriptural. Read it. It's right there. Mocking and mocking and pulling every fast when they can. Over the world. <laughs> the darn newspapers. They don't make them like they used to. Darn newspapers. Why, this is such a priceless city. These women will not come up with the idea of collecting rainwater and shipping it anywhere they have Earl, the bribery product of the planet, and trading straight across tanker for tanker. Rainwater for oil. Portland, Oregon. By, pass by all the corruption and crap, we buy ours direct. We trade water for oil. Portland, Oregon. They don't come up with ideas like that. And by God, they need to. They collect the rainwater here and sell it and send it everywhere and drink it. Well, you never even need a sewer system or anything here. They're outdated, these females. 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 What? Females are outdated? Ha! I looked at one today walking around in high heels. I thought, you know, they're not the same as me. I couldn't do that. I know damn well my dignity for myself wouldn't let me walk around like that. I just I couldn't do it as a, as a male of my kind. I couldn't do it. Too humiliating. They're not the same as me. We are not equal. We are very mutual. And I hold them priceless of more value than me. They were not the same as me. I have the old soft shoe, and so do you. Well, you do it different than me. A high heels is not the same as me. Let's undress and look in the mirror together. Huh? Let's look stark naked at each other, standing in front of full-length mirrors, and you tell me you're the same as me. No, you're not. Want a bat? Let's just look at each other's anatomy, and you tell me you're the same. Are you? Equal with me. Really? Am I blind or are you stupid? We are not equal. Take a look. And you are priceless. And I, it looks to me like I'm superior. <laughs> what should you then be? Priceless or superior? They both are pretty cool places. You know, you think they'd get along? Priceless and superior. Why don't they get along? Why are they going to be calling each other equal when they're mutual? Priceless, superior, mutual. Why are they going to be equal? Who's pulling the fast one on who? Huh? I don't get it. I know I wouldn't cover you up. How they do that in the Middle East, cover their women up, is the dumbest thing I ever saw. They're priceless. Why cover them up? They're beautiful. Why cover a woman up like that, a female? Why? Oh, they lust. I'll be darned. How do you look at a car? I see how you look at a car. You'd rather have that than any woman. I can sure see that. I want it for the woman. <laughs> I just bet you do. Dork. 
Wonder the woman. You're an idiot. Now the women act like idiots to attract you. <laughs> Staggering. What's going on in humanity is mind-boggling and not thought through. Is it? Not even talked about, is it? Is it ever talked about? No, it isn't. You can't have a conversation in class about it. She'll freak. Let's open our books. Let's not open our books. Let's have a conversation with tone of voice and everything and motion and like children in a sandbox. Let's do it that way. And get along and have a lot of good time and laugh at each other. And Wow, let's do it naked. What do you say? I'm embarrassed, aren't you? I'm all. Let's get embarrassed. 